All right, all right, here we go with today's multiplayer round. Hope y'all are having a great weekend. We got a match. We got Necro, 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 Frozen Valley, Highlander Ridge, Lost Island. Let's go with my regular bag. Don't see any water skip. And come on, give us some more players. Frozen Valley 9. I've been actually having some some better luck here lately. We're going to go with bottom chevron right on the corner there. And a little less than a disc of hyzer when I aim that high. That's going to be way too wide, but hopefully we get a nice skip down around everything. The nice thing about that line is I don't have to worry about the trees or the poles. But it won't get down quite as far, so it'll be a little harder of an eagle shot. Still have a, a look at it here. 172. Go forehand with the piece. Take about 20 feet off of this. And drop. Oh, right on line. Didn't quite drop enough. Just cut that top rim and we get the birdie. <clears throat> par three coming up. Looks like a couple more par threes for Frozen Valley. Let's see what we got. Nice wind. We're definitely going to run it here with our little Vando water skip. Slide to the right. Bottom chevron right on top of this tree and a full Anheuser. And hopefully into the basket this looks like it has a chance maybe oh dang such a fun one to get but I missed it just to the right oops 78 feet still get our birdie no such luck on the ace but we were close Let's see what we got for the next one this is hole one of the daily challenge. Should I try? I'm going to try the line I use. I basically just took some power off of it. Default aim, glide, skip, arrive. We're going to put a little bit of hyzer and see how this works for us. Oh man, I couldn't remember the wind. I think it was the left to right, so that's why that did not work. Shouldn't have done that because I didn't remember the wind. Looks like we can still save this 70 feet. Got it to go. We're done with Frozen Valley, three under. Moving on to the next course, a couple par threes, par four, Thor, Highlander Ridge. With this wind here, I think I'm still gonna go with the PD. I'm gonna put a disc worth of hyzer looks pretty good there just give me a nice bounce up towards the basket it does get the easy birdie here and we stay tied with Mr. Necro looks like he's from Germany at least that's where the flag is from Not gonna run it in this wind. We're just gonna go roll sapphire. Take a little bit off of this. And not much hyzer is needed with that big left to right. Oh man. Kind of a bad bounce off that rock there. 56 feet. Little right to left tailwind. Gotta be gentle with that one. Took about 15 feet off of that. Par four coming up. Let's see if this is a separator hole we may not have many of them so this might be our only option got a nice big wind makes it tougher to hit the gap for me I don't have a flippy skip driver but if I hit it I should be up there in a good position to uh, get the eagle we're gonna put quite a bit of ante on this get around that corner oh yeah big skip nice Dang, looks like he got it. Now we got to get it 78 feet. So we both get the eagle. We stay tied. 
no separation moving into our last course I've already forgotten what it is lost island all right maybe we can get them here with the old vandal my normal aim point but with this wind we're gonna aim this way a tad looks like he went for the island too did he looks like he's in the water so the vandal is gonna save us this round we're gonna get a stroke on him and see how we do on hole number eight which is hole number eight of lost island as well see what the wind's doing should be able to make it over in this wind just got to be careful not to turn it too much looks pretty perfect with the glide turn rive did he skip across? It looks like he did. So he's a little farther back, but he possible to get the eagle from back there. Just a little harder than from up here. So we'll see if I get another stroke on him. 482. I'm going to go with the glide roll arrive. Let it just kind of fade back slowly. Hopefully not hit this tree. It won't. Oh, big old skip for a roll disc. Oh, he did get the eagle. Well done on that from back there. 54 feet. High chains. Oh, stayed in for me. So he's still got the one-shot lead. Mistake-free round so far. Par 4 coming up. Let's see what we, can, what we can do. There's always a chance at eagle here. So we'll see if he can tie us up or if I can just put it in and slam the door shut on this round. Got a nice skip. This should be within piece range. 182. He did not get it, so I don't need to make this, but still going to try. A little bit of Annie, not much. Oh, man. Just short, right in line. Couple of those that round right on line, just a little high and a little short, but still a solid round, no mistakes. We got the win. Take a look at his bag, the pure dagger combo. We don't see that too often. Compass and anchor, another combination you don't see very often. The musket, he's got a musket without anything, just a regular old musket. He's got a roll ballista. That's this is a weird bag. To be level 400 something and to see these types of discs in there they're just kind of weird a light skip rive that's different huh anyway it's got the light skip and the light glide but there you go guys there's today's multiplayer round hope you enjoyed have a good rest of the weekend and as always thanks for watching me play some dgv